Hey guys, it's me! Sorry I haven't made too many videos recently, but I just finished the, the last games from... The last games that I had to play from the tournament, so I just wanted to make the my screen video here. Just wanted to put a little note here. You'll notice one game is missing between... Me and someone, I can't even think of who it is now. Frosty Teeth, yeah, because of course, you know, it being me, I accidentally deleted it. Yeah, what else would you expect? And then also, I play a uh, I play a match with Blue here that wasn't scheduled in the tournament, but we ended up doing it as a tiebreaker. Um, but yeah, that's the explanation. Oh, and also the first game in the elimination bracket was forfeited, so I didn't end up playing that one. So that's why that's why there's only one in the elimination bracket. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, should I say something here? I don't know. Ah, you know what else I just noticed is that I also deleted my first game against Mazarin, so we're just going to start with game two. Ha! I'm very good at keeping these things. Epic the Boneyard. This time I think I will do a rush. This time... I'm thinking I will do the rush of the rail guards. And see if I can kill him very early in the game. But the only time will tell if this is effective or no. I hope he is ready. For I will come at him very quickly with the rail guns. And it will be deadly. I just really hope I don't run out of memory in my computer. I don't know why, but like, something is taking out the memory in my C drive. Like, really fast. I don't know what it is. I'm, I, I don't record to that drive, so like, I don't know. I don't know. It's a little odd. Oh well. So in order to pull this one off, we're gonna retire the base runner, we pop one of them things out. And, uh yeah, you need to be making a solid form too, don't you? And I wanna do some kind of quick drop as well. Like that maybe. Yeah. Oh that was perfect. See that? Did you see that? Alright. And then I think you go to Sandskinner Fabrication before you make any other salvagers, but I'm not totally sure. I can never remember exactly. See, if that's 35 seconds and that's got 60 on it, then yeah, right about halfway. Seems about right to me. This is probably correct, but I don't know. I, I've actually really been meaning to watch some replays from Sparrow recently, uh, just like see how he used to do it, but. I keep uh, putting it off and then just not actually ever doing it, so... Just kind of come to terms with the fact that my railgun rush will be, like, slightly suboptimal, probably. Um, and then again, this is on the mod anyway, so I mean, it's gonna be slightly different with the timings, with the base when I give me RUs like that, so... Oh my gosh, please. Alright. <laughs> So you guys are group one, let's start making them skims. Uh, we need to stack up like 450, and they're about to drop. Yeah, so I should probably, well, I can probably make one more. Oh, easy. The game is up! The game is up! I wasn't doing anything wrong! Yeah, I think he knows. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he hasn't seen it though, maybe. Well, the hope at this point is that I'll be able to pull it off even though he knows it's coming. But uh, that's honestly not so ridiculous as perhaps it sounds. Although, he's got a lot of dudes. Yes, yeah, so I think making those salvagers was a mistake. But I don't know. Anyway, railgun rushes are quite hard to hold off. Anyone who's played against Sparrow can tell you that. No extraction coming out, which is excellent for me. I want to pick a fight with him here, but I mean, I don't have the units for it, so it's a little bit silly too. I mean, he should really just pop over the hill and wreck me, right? But he doesn't want to, apparently. 
And uh, I can just outproduce him here, and eventually I'm gonna win. Um, oh yeah, it's, especially if he picks up. Oh, he's got a lot of dudes. I just need to keep stacking up uh, skimmers until I'm ready to push out like that. Who is he, who's he attacking? Oh, it's this guy. Okay. Dang it! Like I couldn't, I couldn't tell. It took me too long to recognize it. That was unfortunate because you you could tell perhaps I was looking to like figure out who he was attacking there so I could pull him back out of the fight. I couldn't figure it out. I didn't know which one he was attacking. Anyway, at about this point, the uh, numbers just start getting too out of his favor. So now I start making heavy rails. I can push him off his second. Uh, that guy's gonna be a little annoying, but not too much. He can be three, can't you? Just need more uh, heavy rails, but. Really good armor one as well. Dude, stop it. Okay, I'll just send the soul rail again back to deal with that in, in you know five years or something. Like you know how effective that's gonna be. Not very effective. But it can be kind of annoying and I can't really do anything about it, so. See, I want you to attack the uh, carrier. Yes. Salvager lost. Uh, see, I didn't think I was going to lose any there. Oh, there's actually two there. Hmm. Basically, I just want to force him to come out and fight me here. If his carrier continues to be sieged out like that, yep, there he is. So he's got to come fight me eventually. And he's got way more LEDs than I expected. Wow. Alright, but that's probably not an issue. He's got armor too? No. Hmm. You can tell by the damage spread here, I'm doing a very bad job of uh, focus firing. Yeah, this is not really the best rush, is it? <laughs> I've kind of botched it. I just didn't, like, yeah, I don't know. I didn't realize he had made so many LADs. Okay, well, I just need to get refinery mode then. I already have rail guns, I forget about that. Uh. Oh, ref mode. Had he gone for some kind of tech? I couldn't tell. I really want to go honor guards already. Just because that's such a, such a hard counter to those LADs. Uh, Railgun Fab is finished, it seems. But what's notably missing is his LAVs. I'm a little bit worried about that. But yeah, let's take up to Honor Guards then. I can tell I'm playing a little odd. I'm not really sure what I'm doing, but it's working, so. I'll keep doing it. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yeah, that's the LAVs, huh? Okay, so he is trying to get behind me then. Might need to back away here. 
Uh, let's pull the cells back then too. Not all of them probably, but just just some of them. <laughs> the carrier can shut this down. It's like I am gonna lose one. I had lost one already though, one more than I rebuilt, so. Uh oh. Careful now. Let's see how far we can push this. Because I would like to not give up the extraction there. If it's possible. It's an assault cruiser. Oh. Well, that's a bit of an odd choice, isn't it? I mean, I'm getting honor guards, obviously, but even like just the railguns, which I already had, that's gonna counter that quite nicely. Do need to be careful, though. That's, um, that's a dangerous unit, but I'm not very scared of that. Put it that way. Bring the heavies up. Bring the heavies to bear. Repeat. Bring the heavies to bear. Ah, I hate homeworld too. It's not you. It's you. <clears throat> so he's gonna chase down the uh, the BR, but it's too late. Uh, so let's see if I can't figure out or like get some get some ground over on this side. That is too late, right? Or is he gonna kill this thing? He's not gonna kill it. Not not in time anyway. You too careful. He is a big. Okay, so I definitely want to be facing that way. Watch out for those missiles. This hill always confuses me, like I never quite figured out. So let it get to those salvagers! Uh. That was messy. I do keep chasing him though. Don't let him get away with that. He didn't just like heal there, did he? I think he might have. No, he didn't, he didn't, but he is gonna die there. Yeah, I really didn't need to lose those guys, but that's right. Um, I have a feeling I'm about to get hit by like a nasty backstab. It's time to move seeds to pop the records and it's funny. Um, oh! It's a carrier. No, it doesn't look like it. Where his carrier is, maybe I can attack around that side though. 
We shall see. We shall see. Don't plan on getting anti air here, but uh, if he gets air, I want to have the options. That's why I've gotten that tech. Am I gonna be? Yeah, no, I'm good. Okay, let's, let's, let's clear him out. Oh, tell me I get a shot off here. I really want it. Mm. Doesn't look great. Yeah, I know. I thought I was gonna just smash all of his LEDs there. Not, not quite. I was a little slow on the draw there, but I do have him in a kind of tight spot, though. got artillery apparently. Uh, maybe he can just punch in and kill it though. Um, he's got his carrier here. Question is how much damage the carrier is going to do, but I don't think it's enough really. Hmm, artillery quite a lot beefier in the mod. I, I kind of forgot about that. Yeah, it's, it's not going to die so quickly as I'm expecting. They, they die really fast in vanilla if you do stuff like that to them. I can't quite get away with that so easily in, in the mod. That's okay though. Uh, we can just strike at this base now if we want to. Um, I think it's good for the these first. Yeah. Maybe you can tell I'm just kind of trying to move around so that I don't get hit by artillery here. Not sure what that heavy railgun is doing there, but um, I will tell you he's gonna die. Oh, 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 yeah, that's, that's why I'm that's why I'm moving around. Uh, maybe we can get it as main now. Well, okay, let's just let's just attack here. Sometimes you guys get stuck on that part of the terrain up there. Seems to be a replicable bug. Uh, just need to watch for his barrage because obviously he might. Uh, he's gonna try to predict like where I'm headed. Oh, no, I didn't do it right. Oh. Because what's interesting about that, yeah, is that um, if you try to predict where he's gonna barrage and then move backwards to like try and juke him, but actually he hasn't done that, then actually you're just gonna get hit by the artillery. It's very, uh, it's very interesting. Turns into quite a meta type of fight. He's putting in much more of a fight this time. Uh, let's get there fast rather than slow. Because that's actually quite a lot of dudes. I think he feels unsafe to like take the fight with me, which is good. That's how I wanted to feel. I wonder if I can stop this extraction here. I do have raiding. Oh, there's a carrier. And the schemer! 
just kill this thing? I'm not sure. I know I have the railgun numbers, I'm just afraid of that artillery basically. I'm not sure if I even should be. I have damage 2 now as well, so I can pull them pretty quick. I'm really more interested in the artifact than anything at this point. Let's see if I can just deny that real quick. In fact, he's going to be taking a bit of friendly fire damage now, which is kind of funny. Friendly fire is not a huge thing in DOK, but it'll happen in this case. And then we can get a couple BRs to see if we can uh, sneak off an extraction there, and that'll close off the game nicely for us. I wonder if I can just, like, raffle my carrier into him. Shouldn't try it, though. I mean, that's, like, a good way to throw, yeah. That's, like, a... That's a strategy I'll pull if I'm, like, feeling like I'm losing. Not when I'm winning like this. So that'd be real da uh, dangerous looking in the original home world, wouldn't it? That's a couple of dudes. I wasn't expecting this totally. Of <laughs> course, the way he put down his jammers there made it hard for him to push on me, too. Can I just go in and get his artillery, actually? Let's see if we can bait him into having the skimmer blob run right in my HGCs. So that'd be hilarious. I've got the artifact, yeah? Okay, good. No, it doesn't look like it. That's what I expected. He's not. He's not stupid. <laughs> kind of have to be to do that. Um, just chase people into the fog of war. I mean, that's like a bozo cow move, you know. By what? By artillery? Okay, it's just a barrage. So we need to snipe his artifact now with my with my guys. Still, he's just got so many of those things. And no, I can't is the answer. But I, it was worth a try. He's doing a good job sticking right behind the dune there. It's, it's difficult to, uh... Difficult to even think of getting a shot off on him with these honor guards, right? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, that's one thing that I don't want to do, is just take damage like this. I mean, if you can see me, then I'm just going to be taking free damage, basically. That's not good at all. Let's just get our power reserves up. Uh, we, we do have a base burner position there, so... In fact, have I got another probe scanner ready? No, I don't. You're fine, you're fine. They're not real! What's going on with these guys? Oh, they're getting absolutely right. That's nice. I'm being really sacrificial with these sand skins. I don't know exactly why. Um, but this time, maybe I can get him to run right into me here. Especially because he needs to stop the extraction now. Get a shot off. No, not quite. Not quite. Yeah, now he needs to back away. Oh, I think I think he's gonna kill my. He's gonna kill my uh, my base runner. That's real sad. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Bit of an odd game. Yeah, see, that's why I picked up this artifact here, so that I'd have something in this scenario. 
Sure. And you can't ever, like, extract because I can just send, like, one guy over there to stop him, and if he tries to deal with it, then uh, he's obviously just gonna lose over on this side where the extraction will go down. Don't want to run into his rails, though, that'd be pretty tragic. That'd be a travesty. Epic proportions. I also just... I don't, I don't want to let this probe just kind of do whatever he wants over here. Remember how I was talking about how he can't extract? I think he probably can if I do this. <laughs> um, I'm not even really trying to stop him, you see. Oh, well... This is how to lose an honor guard cruiser for nothing. That's fun. But what if Cruiser was not kill? Spoiler, Cruiser really was kill. Battle Cruise? What the heck? That's not gonna work. Oh, and I'm also extracting here, so I mean that's also game over, but yeah. Bit of an odd game, wasn't it? I, all my games right, uh, so far have been kind of odd. All my games today, anyway. But My two games with him, this is what I mean to say. It's, it's because I haven't played in like a while, actually. I, I've always been kind of meaning to, but... I feel like I've been waiting for my tournament games and like not playing other games. It's kind of a silly way to be, isn't it? But I did win, and I feel happy about that. Alrighty then. Um, so, I want to know what faction he is, but I can't, obviously, he's random. Uh, I want to rush him anyway. I think, I don't know. I think it'll go well. I don't want to play Eco and not know what he is until he attacks me, right? So I think fighting him early is probably better. I guess we shall see, though. Shallant we. With what shall I rush him... Perhaps? I, I think I'll do rails because it's just it's kind of safer. Didn't I tell you to make a solid rail? Alright. I hate the inefficiency. Oh my gosh. Alright. We're good, we're good. Okay, well it's a probe, so that... That narrows it down quite a lot already. He's probably gonna see what's up here. Let's see if we can kill the probe. Yeah, that's a dead probe right there. Which is very good for me. <coughs> But he knows this would be our retirement scheme, so he probably knows what's coming, or at least he should. Fleet cap up and off we go. Um, and now... We just need to save up to rail... Oh, I already have the, the R use for it. I should have not made these sand skimmers just yet, but that's alright. Um, this is a pretty small map anyway, so I want to have them a bit earlier than usual. Uh, you didn't, you didn't quick drop. That's not how you do it. Alright, there we go. Alright. <laughs> so apparently my carrier is not quite close enough to these guys, actually. Which is funny. Oh, he's extracting? Oh, let's just let him do it. He's still gone, alright, so... Uh... 
that can be good and bad at the same time. He can't put down a turret, but... Oh, hey. Have a good one. My roommate half left. Alright, so let's see. The game's up now, yeah, he knows exactly what's going on. Fortunately, he seems to have gone SC first, which is, like, terrible for him. Yeah, there's the carrier, he kind of needed to pull it out. But he does have an extraction already, so that's uh, to his benefit, I suppose. Now we just need to get the railgun count up. Oh, especially if there's already AAVs out on the field. Of course, AV is considerably less tanky. Maybe I can do a thing with the sand skimmers, but really, it's the real guns that's gonna that's gonna kill him here. The ALN can actually be kind of nasty to my, uh, whatchamacallums now, uh, the railguns, so I don't want to let the, don't want to let those live. Alright, <laughs> I bled so many skimmers there, that was not good. Oh, he's dead though. <laughs> All right. It's noticeably harder to pull off in the mod, I think uh, that's the railguns do less damage, which is probably good. Um, Carrier has less health too, but still it's, uh, it's a little difficult to... It's a little bit more difficult to pull it off than it used to be. Good. Have fun. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> I can type sometimes. <laughs> okay, we are continuing our game on the Firebase Krill. Krill? The base of fire. It's a very interesting map, but I like it quite a lot. This one I'm gonna do a bit more standard. I could try to give him a scare, if you know what I mean, by like uh, popping up with all my units. Like like popping up with the production crews at like just the right time to do like a railgun push or something like that, but then not actually having railgun tech, but I don't think I'll do that. It's a fun idea though, um, but yeah. I don't know what faction he is though, so I do need to be careful about blast drone shenaniganry. Uh, frame rate's not terribly good, but that's probably alright. Oh, I'm not playing my, my tournament music. That explains why things got a little sheaf with Mazarin. I wasn't playing my tunes. I mean, how can I be expected to win in that kind of environment? It's a normal base rescue coalition, right? Did I kill the probe? I should have. Uh, I should have chased it. 
Okay, let's get Fleet Cap up and, uh, did I miss? Okay, I thought I had missed. Let's get Fleet Cap up and see if we can challenge him in his base. Probably only at like half, yeah, I did, I did not kill it. Yeah, he seems to be holding off pretty nicely, so we'll flip to Pico. Uh, come on, you can make it. All right, excellent. Better not put down a turret there, though. That'd be very annoying. Oh, uh, I lost it. <laughs> so much for that sand skimmer that I heroically saved. It's all pointless. Get up on the high ground, please. Yeah, that's fine, that's fine. Well, no, don't do that. Let's go to any salt ship line this time. That's a fun one. Okay, lose that guy, that's okay. Really, I'd like to stop his extraction now, if it's possible. I don't know. I kind of feel like I spent too much time attacking LAVs there, which I was taking the fight quite nicely, but this is obviously a bit more important, right? I think he gets out. I don't know if there's any way to stop that. But you don't get off of high ground. <laughs> oh, well, maybe. Haha! -ha. Feels bad, man. <clears throat> oh. I guess we just run through it, huh? I've got quite a lot of uh, help from that boy. Let's just go straight to siege. Oh, yeah, he's got armor units, so let's uh, let's not do that. I do want to kill off these pesky LAVs here if I can. And he's not really chasing, so that's nice. Oh, he is chasing now. Well played, sir, well played. I kind of played myself there, didn't I? I'm fleet yeah. okay. Uh, But... AV not really survivable well enough, it seems to exploit my weakness, so... We're good. I should probably be getting interceptors here, though. Just for, like, the anti-air. Well, maybe I don't need it. Uh, I think I'll actually go for missile missile ships here, just like fix things up a bit. I'm a bit tired of that meta. And I do have um, I'm gonna need defenses too already, so I mean, they're they're gonna benefit from that quite a lot. So 
My guys are getting a bit mixed up there, that's funny. Uh, let's heal before we pick it up. I picked it up anyway, excellent. All right. <laughs> that was intentional, that's what I wanted to do. That is certainly what I wanted to do. Let's get the EMP shell just because we never use it. Um, so I'd like to try something a bit new, right? It's like, he's got armor one. See, I take that kind of fight, so that's completely fine for me. About to suggest my my base runner fire a you know like siege barrage at them. That doesn't work that way. I think I'm gonna lose this guy here, right? Or maybe I can kill him for it. Yeah, that was a choke. That's all right. It's completely fine. My multitasking is not great right now. I don't know why exactly. Well, no, let's go into rails, I guess. Um, but I'm still fleet capped. I thought I had just gotten the tech for that. No, I guess not. Yes, yeah, so I accidentally bound those guys to five, which is really inconvenient. Get another base burner. Oh, he left. Yeah, I guess he figured it was over from there. He hadn't even seen I had siege yet, actually, so it's kind of funny. Didn't really use it particularly well, but yeah. Alright. That's GG. Now you may be asking yourself, why are we playing? Um, because we're actually tied for first right now, which is kind of interesting, isn't it? <laughs> uh, just because we've both gone undefeated in the in our brackets so f or in our groups so far. Um, I don't think this is necessary, but like, hey, you know, why not? <laughs> I think. I think a round robin can be done without um, without having tiebreakers between the groups, but I didn't totally set it up correctly, so it's kind of my fault anyway. So we just won't say anything about it. Max Cartobo, that was picked by RNG, mind you. This one I probably won't enjoy too much. Um, this map because it's like way too big, I think. Like, I say way too big. It's not too big. Um, it's just too big for me. I, I enjoy the maps being a little bit smaller. If they're as small as Kalash Teeth, it can make problems because... Uh, because... <clears throat> how do I say? Like, AAV rushes and stuff like that are just unstoppable, right? But I think this kind of size of map is probably just a little bit too big for me. I can't remember actually if I've done that one yet. Uh, what's my natural? That's my natural.
Is that the only one I have left from that group? It might be. I've got to take this one though, right? I mean. Let's just make sure I'm not getting BD rushed or anything silly. Because that'd be funny if I ended up losing this and, and Blue comes out on top of the of the of the, uh, the group stage. I got him backed up to his main. I feel like I should just finish it here. Rather than rather than wait, you know, for like eco bonuses or whatever. That'd be kinda kinda lame. Second PC though, so I should probably just head out then. Can't fight that obviously. Um in which case I probably wanna Get one of my own before too long. Oh wow, I actually got killed by something there. Um, I actually want to fight him close then, in that case. Right, because like in this scenario, I'm I outnumbered him, but I won't for long. So. that guy. And then uh, probably I want to go for rails too. drop but I just don't have the energy for that <laughs> but yeah I'm gonna basically just try to hold this on two base and have more railguns than him unless he goes for assault ships but I feel like that's not gonna work for other reasons but let's see if we can't I mean this map is so big I should be able to harass him while his units are like over there or over there or something um and that'll also kind of tell me where he isn't right because I haven't seen him coming down this corridor so he must be like right there right now yeah see that that's actually closer than I thought it would be like to his base which is good for me Oh, how'd that guy get there though? I feel like maybe he's not actually pushing off the back of this, which is what he should be doing. I mean, if he's not pushing, I can actually get away with going for more economy, but I feel like that'd be pretty greedy. I probably probably shouldn't do that. Um, tell you what then, let's go for some assault railguns. Uh, I don't suspect he's on this base, but he could be, and that's an interesting thing about this map. But yeah, it doesn't look like he is. Um, let's get Rogan. I remember up. How many guys is that? Seven? Got yeah, six. And then I could honestly take this with a good base runner heal, but let's not, let's not risk that. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we don't want to be there. This is a little tricky. Okay, no, I'm fine. I, I wonder if he's got raiding, though, because I might have backed myself into a corner here. No, it doesn't look like he does. Oh, I'm fleet captain. Of course I am. Of course I am. <laughs> when would I not be, right? Mm, you don't want to be there. Is that a heavy rail? Yeah, it is. But I, I think I'm okay, though, right?
Uh, well, I mean, this could actually be a little tricky, so... Let's not take it for granted that I'm gonna win this one. I guess I'll just wait for the artifact to get healing, actually. I don't really need... I don't really need anything else. Yeah, so rather than try to fight it with rails, I think I'll just, uh, mass sell here. Because I, I think I can, you know. In which case, upgrade's probably not a bad idea. And I notice he's got them and I don't, too, so... I have more production than him, I've got more money than him, too, so... If we can hide these guys behind the hill, even, we can maybe pop them on him. Yeah, it's going well. But yeah, I don't want to let that production cruiser get away. I think I can kill him, so... And his tech was really good, so I don't need to worry about air for a bit. Which is nice. Is that an armored unit? I think it was. Yeah, it is. Should have been back there a bit earlier then, but I can still kill the PC here, obviously, so. And I guess it's time to get some heavies, huh? Although I'm fleet capped, of course. What else would you expect from your boy Bozo Cal? I guess we need to scrap this one. The extraction is like so far on this map that I can actually just go for the same artifact over and over again, which is kind of interesting. Can't usually get away with that. Am I still what? Oh yeah, I hadn't actually started getting it yet. Um, I could just push him with my carrier here, but I don't really want to. I feel like that'll honestly take the long. Uh, wouldn't take longer, would it? But. But yeah, I won't do that. Do need to watch for air. This is obviously a pretty air-heavy map, but things are looking good. Don't get too close now. Is he behind a hill? Oh. Uh, Let's get the Railgun EMV rounds, just because we never use them. You know, I want, want them to feel like things are fair. Huh? I'm not sure why my guys are silent, by the way, but... Oh, and I have Honor Guards, too. I should really get them, shouldn't I? you go another way then. <laughs> it's kind of odd. Maybe the pathing around that is a little broken. And you know, an, an artifact extraction could finish this off quite quickly, which would be nice. Uh, I always want more anti-air than I think I need. Because then you always need more than you think you will. Was it E for the MP? Yeah, it is. Alright, so let's see what this thing can do. Huh? Thank you. 
Oh my gosh, look at the cooldown on that. Oh, like the charge up on that thing. It's terrible. Yeah, that's gonna be really hard to use. Um, <laughs> I can see why no one ever gets this now. Okay, I hit him there. Aha, we got him. And then it barely lasts long at all. Okay, so I, I, I can see why this is not really a, an ability that people actually use. I think I've got... Yeah, see the thing is it'll actually hit over Dooms too though I believe, which is nice. Oh yeah, I should probably take these two out, shouldn't I? Uh, <laughs> Honor Guard is finished as well, which I'm not really bringing in yet. Oh, he's got Siege. I can also fire into the uh, into the no man's land here too, can't I? And so if I know where he is, I can hit him like that without him even being able to see me, which is kind of nice. Oh, okay. So its range is a lot smaller than I was expecting. Which also kind of complicates things a bit. Huh? Uh, before we should uh, fight that guy. Sandskip is just getting melted here, which is fun. Alright, well... That is gonna be game though, but... I feel like there's actually a lot of potential there, but I've never seen that used uh, particularly effectively, so I'd be curious to see what it can do. Anyway. Yeah, you can see the resource differential here. Uh, because I was allowed to fall back and get eco, that was very effective for me. And it can be a little tricky to hold it if my opponent pushes, but I just know the boo never will, really. Um, I shouldn't... I shouldn't say that. He can change. People do change. But right now he doesn't. <laughs> That's one thing I think he should improve on, is like when he's got that kind of an attack, just like push out. Um, but then again, like the way that the map is set up, I was going to be able to harass him on the back line with the skimmers, even, even if he did. And I still think I would have held it, because he had a long way to go before he could get to me. But yeah. That's that. This'll be the one, man. How confident do I feel in this game? Not very confident, I gotta say. Because <laughs> I haven't been playing much, really, for a while now. I mean, then again, neither is he. But, I don't know. I, I don't feel this is gonna go particularly well, but I don't really mind. I'm also not, like, particularly invested in it for some reason. I normally have been in the past, but for some reason I just feel like I don't really care if I win this or not. So that's probably not going to affect me particularly positively either. I assume he's typing, but he hasn't said anything. Um, who gets first map pick? I need to check.
<laughs> there, you happy M7? <laughs> yeah, no, I need to check who gets first map pick. It might, it might be me here. Um. <laughs> Let us see. It's in the rules, of course. Map selection. Starting with the lower seed, which is me, yeah, because I came out of the, I came out of the group stage first, actually. Yeah, I'm one. He's four. <clears throat> So which map do I want to ban then against him? I don't need to ban Kalash Teeth anymore, because the AAV rush is not so insane. I think... I think I want to ban the Shallows. The Boneyard I also generally feel a bit shaky on. So one of those two I'm not going to want to play on. Let's go for the Boneyard. Yeah, because I don't want Your man, I can spell. Um, yeah, no, I don't want to play on the boneyard. I just don't feel particularly good about it. He's probably gonna ban Torin. That'd be kind of the smart choice here. And I'm just assuming we've announced faction that I'm Gals and he's random. Um, GT Alt is a really good map for me. Torin's a good one. I'm expecting him to ban it though. Kalash I would be fine with, and then Firebase I really like. So those are the ones I'm hoping to get here. And I don't expect he's going to want to play Dune Ocean or uh, or Kartoba because they're so big, right? Prime Anomaly it's called, yeah. And he doesn't generally like that kind of map, so I don't think there's really any chance that those two are going to end up getting picked. So we're probably going to be on GT Alt. Uh, Like Kalosh and Firebase, that's probably what's gonna happen. We'll have to see though. <clears throat> I bet Twitch will like notify me that he's that he's streaming. In fact, let's let's check. No, not yet. Wait. Yes, he is. Look at that. Oh, he bans Karto. Okay, he really doesn't want to play on it. Alright. That's good for me, because I, I didn't really want that one either. Um, which means I can pick Torin, which obviously it was kind of expected, <laughs> but still. So Torrin is map one. <clears throat> I'm expecting Firebase. He could do Shallows, actually. That's the one that I wouldn't want. Which means he should pick it. Oh, this is a best of five. No, wait, no, it's not. No, no. I thought it was best of five for a second. No, it's just a uh, best of three. Uh, do I? I? I didn't think so. I wrote these rules. <laughs> I think I even noted on here, yeah. Failure to run the patch results in YouTube humiliation. No, I'm pretty sure it's just one ban, right?
Yeah, I'm asking that because he might want to not play on Torin. No, it looks like he's okay. Okay. Yeah, so I picked Torin. So what's he gonna pick? Like I said, I think the Shallows is the right pick for him, but he picks Kosh. Okay, that's very good. And then I'm gonna pick Firebase. Okay. Like I said, not feeling particularly confident, but not really feeling like I'm gonna be too upset about that either. Um, but the question is, what do I want to do? <coughs> Let's shock the world by playing Eco. I never do that. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, that could actually be like an effective strategy, especially because it's Torin, and so he's gonna be thinking like, yeah, like, this is a, uh, this is like Bozo Cal's map to attack me, but I'm not gonna do it. Um, instead, I'll go for like a two base push. Um, let's make this a basement of retirement as well then. I don't know what faction he is, and that makes things a little bit scary, but I imagine he's gonna tell me. Uh, but even if, he, even if he doesn't, like, he's not going to be expecting this. He's expecting to be on the defense, I'm sure. See my base runner Zorp in there? Yeah, he's still on, it looks like. Uh, you guys are supposed to be harvesting, right? You can just get retired. Yeah, there's a little bit of lag, you can tell, but it should be fine. Uh, you're supposed to drop off, buddy. Pointed vans underway. <laughs> I mean, we're just gonna go like all out greed, like refinery mode first type of all out greed, you know what I'm saying? Before even Fleet Cap 45 or Sand Skimmer Fab or anything. This is quite risky. I wouldn't normally recommend this, but because uh, I imagine he's gonna try to counter strat against me by getting ready for like a, a push right in the very beginning, this is gonna work. That's that's my that's my game plan here. So getting skimmer fabrication about as fast as possible is going to be the move from here now. I do have some extra RUs as well because it's the patch, right? So the base burner gives me some. These guys should probably open the wreck maybe. I don't know. <laughs> been, been just a little bit since I played the game. Um, but yeah, so I don't need to the, get these guys on RUs. But that could maybe be useful if I want to go for like an early tech here. And then we'll just fill out the space. And then uh, we can maybe even save up for like a production cruiser actually. Because we're not going to be able to do anything for at least like, you know, 15 seconds. How much money does that get us? You know, he was talking about in the next version of the patch increasing the cost of the uh, production cruiser to have some RUs in it. That was a very interesting idea. Um, and based on like what he wants it to achieve, I could see that actually being really good. We don't see any units at all yet, so I'm feeling okay to go into a, another PC right away. I should really quick drop there, but that's alright. And then I'm going to want to make some skimmers. Ah, he is here.
Has he got upgrades or no? So I should take this, I think, but not now though. However, he he has attrition and I don't, so that's nice. Yeah, I've got a lot of RUs actually, wow. So I'm gonna wanna go for some kind of tech now. He's definitely gonna try to punish off the back of this. But I don't think he should be able to, because my production is gonna be pretty good. That's why I went for the PC early. But he's got AVs coming, so we gotta go railguns, fast pulse. That's gonna really hurt, actually. I don't know if I'm ready for that, really. Uh, we should pull back here. Yeah, this is not good, obviously. Um, but since he's going to be going after the, uh, the eco, I'm thinking maybe we can... Uh, oh, no, but this, <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> Really need to watch if he's killing off a production cruiser or not. That's going to be important. He's not going for the PC, which is good for me. Um. But yeah, we're going to lose a lot of soldiers here. Uh-oh. Guy's way too close, obviously. Okay, so the follow-up here for him is obviously going to be, uh... The follow-up for him is obviously going to be air, right? Let's see... Yeah, no, so the follow-up for him is obviously going to be air. Um, so I need to get anti-air up quickly, but I don't want to fall behind eco, so this is going to be a little tricky to hold. He definitely did a lot of really good damage there, so that much is for sure. Who are we fighting here? Just no idea. That's good. It's all who we want to be fighting. Oh, he's already got them. Oh, jeez. All right. So I was uh, prioritizing eco a little bit too much, apparently. He's got ALMs here, but that shouldn't really be an issue. But the carrier is kind of. Let's see. Can we pick one of these off, maybe? I think we can. But yeah, we definitely have issues here. Uh oh, you're not supposed to be there. <laughs> I think they didn't get my order because they had gotten uh, hit by something, like they had gotten stunned. Yeah, and I, I saw the blip there too, so I know there's something there. Yeah, so I mean, I knew that was the follow-up, I just didn't think he would have it so fast. Looks like he's going for the skimmers though, which is really good for me. Um, because obviously he could be doing a lot more damage to the eco right now but he can't because he's taking out sand skimmers instead. And I think we need a heavy, actually. Although, I still might have strike craft problems, honestly. I guess we'll have to see.
Yeah, but this is definitely how you punish eco play. He's doing a good job of that. Let's just watch for LAVs. Huh? But I mean, I'm not worried about the AAV here, am I? So. too many of these missile ships here, I'm not sure exactly how many I need. Group 3 had a, had a quick end there. <laughs> Okay, so we've kind of stabilized here, but not into a good position. Um, need heavies, I think, and I need uh, sand skimmers now. I'm actually kind of nicely covered for air, although I'm fleet capped, as you can see. Which, you know, that means it's a good opportunity to get honor guards, I guess. Which is a tech that I actually think I could use here. Okay, there's fleet cap. I'm just like... I needed to do something. What's the thing? Oh yeah, I'm still fleet cap. Anyway, let's just get one of these guys down here. Make sure I'm not getting flanked or anything silly. But yeah, I really can't afford to lose these uh, railguns here because I'm already kind of behind. So I need to be really careful with them. It's a really nice position for an armored unit. But I should be able to barrage him though. Barrage. They do a lot more, like, damage, I guess, to armored units in the patch because, of course, armored units have got less health now, so. And I wouldn't overstress that effect, but, I mean, it is definitely true. 550-270, so I've actually got the money for one right now. Let's, let's do it, then. Um, okay, so let's see if, mm, I don't want to move through the middle of the map is the thing. Um, because that's, you know, it's Torrent Crater, you'll just die. <laughs> so let's see if we can move around, like, on this hill here and get something done, maybe. I'm gonna try to stay just a little bit split up. Don't want to get hit by anything too hard. Uh, so there's his... ...thing. Okay, so he does have those, so I can cancel that. We just need to get uh, coverage against these skimmers now. Let's get cars with two then. That's what the honor guard does for me, right? But I don't have it yet, obviously, so. And I'm also kind of low on production here. I'd, I'd like to get another production unit. Uh, I can't barrage on this pass here, can I? Yeah, so I need to get this guy up in the front, because he's got the barrage, and that's going to maybe save me here in some way. Okay, but here's the honor guard. So now I feel like I'm actually ready to push out. It's got to be a better way to assign my units than that. Okay, so he's going to go for like a backstab here. Not really sure what to do about it. Was that an assault prisoner? Salvager taking Foff! This is a real battle here. I don't know, I don't think I killed that assault cruiser. I would like to have, but I did not. Let's 
I guess he's healing though, so this would be an excellent time to kill it. Oh, I think I just chunked his uh, LAVs too. Okay, this is actually looking really good though. Just, uh, In this quite a lot. What the? Are you are you still alive? He's got another assault cruiser, okay. Okay, so maybe I overextended just a bit here. But this is this is I think going fairly well. Okay, this is suddenly not going very well. <laughs> I'm not sure exactly what changed, but uh, I need to step on those rails, I think, but I don't know if I can. But we're gonna try it. <laughs> Yeah, he's totally on my honor guard, which is quite problematic. He can't get away at all. It's still a cruiser, isn't it? Hmm. I don't know, I thought I had this, but it does not look like it now. Uh oh. Yeah, no, I think my carry is gonna die here now. Yeah, that's GG. Hmm, so what did I miss during that push? Because I feel like I should easily have had that. But I feel like I had him routed, but then suddenly, I don't know, it didn't work out. Maybe it's because I ran past a bunch of ALMs, I don't know. Not sure. What's the map 2? It's College Teeth, right? I think he's, he's thinking that slash C clears, but yeah. It just checks patch, doesn't actually clear it. Okay, so... This time, we're gonna go full out railgun rush, is the idea. Now, A game's good at holding this kind of stuff, but if I play my cards right, I should be able to get him anyway. This is this is tricky. Um, if I had gotten game one, I'd feel very good about this, you know what I mean? It's Con F. Okay, that's probably good, actually. Um, Con F has a really defensive carrier in the early game, but it can't get powered up really, so I don't have to worry about funny stuff happening if the rush fails. He does have the BDs, which means he's got a bit more frontline production um, during my rush, but that shouldn't be an issue. Uh, guys. Guys! Guys! <laughs> you rusty boys. Go and get wreck. Skim a fab. Am I supposed to get skimmer fab before any soldiers? I think I maybe did this wrong, but we'll just have to see. If I did, it's not going to be not going to be that bad.
Yeah, I can usually get away with making. I can usually get away with making two salvagers here. Thing is, what, what is that that I'm seeing? Oh, it is. Okay, yeah. I think he wants to BD rush or something. This is unfortunate because he's gonna. See, yeah, the game is up now. Like he knows what I'm doing. Um. And I also need to check for BDs now, which is not really what I wanted to be doing. Uh, you guys, <laughs> get on high ground, pulse. I mean, I can obviously take this because I have the extra production here, but it's gonna perhaps cost me a bit. Could you maybe, like, produce out of the right unit? Oh, dear. No. <laughs> I can't... Ah, stop that. Yeah, so he's making out of the wrong one, which is kind of hurting me here. Yeah, he got so much time there that he really shouldn't have been able to get. That's a good juke that he did there. Oh no. Oh no. Woo! Thank you, Sajuk. Sajuk, take the wheel! Seventy, seventy, right? Oh, okay. So it's gonna be tricky to catch up with that. Has he got the armor upgrade? He does. All right. I, I was actually gonna fight him if he didn't. Yeah, he'd love to get that extraction. I don't think I can stop him. Uh, it doesn't seem like it. See if we go around here if we can bait him to bring the skimmers in. Because actually I don't want to leave the production cruises alone like that, but he doesn't need to know that, right? How did he get there? <laughs> oh no. Uh, this is officially very bad. I'll just stand still and get hit. Uh. What the what what happened over there? <laughs> I turn around for like two seconds and everyone's dead. 
Yeah, it's GG. What, what happened over there? <laughs> uh, that's a little disappointing. That is all. I hope you are enjoy it. <laughs>